Mr. Collier, how goes the refinery pad or whatever we're calling this? So it's almost there. Minus yeah. the fact that it hasn't actually refined anything yet, but we got assembly oh. and everything all kind of set in stone. I just need to basically build the rest of it now, like the walls and stuff yeah. like that. Give it some protection just in case whoever those guys were the other day come back. Um, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Now I'm going to build some walls, maybe a roof. I don't know if we keep it an open complex or not, but we'll see. Okay. Well, I'll leave you in the capable hands to organize that one while I go and bug Mr. Finn, wherever he is. Who's capable hands? Hello. Where are you? Mine? I'm literally running back from a surveying mission. Did... Oh, what were you surveying? Uh, just looking at some of the other wrecks around the place. See if there was anything else of salvageable purpose for us. I... Ah, good. Can you meet me near the Vengeance and I we can have a chat about that? Yeah, can do. I'm going to shoot Ranger, who's apparently got the world in his, in his comms. Ah. We can hear a refrigerator! Get away from the mess! Josh. Honestly. You train him up as officers. Wait, no, he's not one of ours. You train him up as lackeys, and apparently they're just open comms in a fridge. Listen, oh, we here at Don't Star take a bit more of a free-spirited approach to rules. Oh, okay. Clan college. Pretty much. It's uh, Catherine basically... in charge of HR. Yes. yes. Oh. I I'm just intervening here to say, like, basically we lock the interviewees in a room with me, and then if they don't annoy me for five minutes, they get the job. Oh, okay. How many have passed? Like, what's the uh, password? We'll need to go to the other side of the plant to find the graves. Right. It's like a mass grave. <laughs> uh, you said me of the vengeance. Which part did you mean? Uh, the front part. Let's start there. I want to know how far you got in, like, salvaging, repairing, whatever, like, and we need to make an executive decision. Well, you need to, like, make a decision, and then I can override it and decide what's best, because that's usually how these things work. I mean... No. Oh. Typical protocol for us was to, um... It was going to be fully disassembled. However, it... There's a lot of history here with this ship. Yeah, definitely. It, it got rid of an entire fleet of badly built ships. I mean, some of them are over there. I know. And <laughs> look... Ours is still in a better condition. I'm not sure how much of that we can put in, I'll be honest. Didn't you build the set? <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> so I made it worse. I have a theory, but I'm not 100% sure. Yeah. Do you think and that theory we, is? Do you think we could put it back to flyable? Can pigs fly? If you strap them to a I rocket, think... yes. Well, in that case, I think we can do it. Though, how we're going to attach both parts, I have no. We're going to need a lot of rigs. Yeah, we're going to need excavation repairs. In terms of strapping it back together, we could, we could modify. We could okay. maybe turn it into a. Detach the front into a detachable ship of its own, right? Oh, he's looked like talking source of separation Star Trek style here. D you know, that other show that was apparently on in this universe. Yeah, that. The hit 1960s show. Yeah. To avoid copyright of like Dave Kirk and uh, Mr. Spurk. I I was thinking more of um an aluminum, uh, aluminum peregrine kind an of. An aluminum falcon. What, what that was originally supposed to have in the front, where the little devity bit is. What? Oh, an aluminium. That's why he's not understanding <laughs> you. Aluminium falcon. The aluminium peregrine. I have no idea what you're on about. Peregrine's a falcon. I've still lost me. The front of the the front of the falcon used to have a cargo container bit that could be detached. In falcon? in solo in millennium so falcon. Saucer oh, separation. Right, sorry. Yeah, not familiar with that universe. Yeah. Well, yeah. Saucer separation is looks at Star Wars channel. Potentially the idea. Okay. Can we like eject it like it's completely useless in a badly written movie then? Could do. A joke. I liked that. I mean, the front is currently look like it's got its face smashed. It does oddly look like a face as well at the minute. Yeah. The bridge has the not been survived. 
<laughs> I mean, there was super lasers flying around. There was like, you know, weird looking ships going around. There was people cheating. It, and, you know, still it managed to survive. Hey, this is Jack. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're keeping that one in. Right. <laughs> uh, we just need an edit of Jack cameo at some point. Just like another Jack just pops into existence. Like, it's like, do you mind? I'm editing this right now. And I'm just thinking, how could you? You prick. <laughs> I, I cut through the door. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, it's the Ooh. medical reactor in here. How's the engine room looking? <laughs> Is it still how it left? Yeah, okay. It, yeah, it, it's we definitely... The drive dirty. section's gone. Yeah, that needs... It's, oh, I've just fallen down the deck. Well, well, I'm back again. This can, this will need to complete over. It might as well strip the entire engine room out and redo. We, yeah, we could do that. Um... We need to get some gantry planks off and ready to go, I think. Because most of the superstruct, well, a part of the superstructure is still here. Like, it's still heavily reinforced. Yeah. It's just going to be a case of redoing critical systems again. I wonder if we could, for lack of a better term, kit bash some of the other wrecks. If there's scrap be We are not making enough for an amalgamation. <laughs> Fair. Fair. Yeah, well, how have you pronounced that? We are not doing that word. <laughs> no, amalgamation was the, the correct term. Oh, thank you, yeah. Sod you, you Scottish <laughs> bastard. Go on. Uh, no, I was meaning if there was, like, sections. Not, like, it, dropping well. an entire ship. If there's, like, a drive section that would work. But... Daddy, how are ships made? Hey, baby. <laughs> baby. It's time for baby's <laughs> first Lego kit. Lego. Okay, yeah, I reckon we could do that. I reckon right now, Finn, we'll get focused on, like, getting our infrastructure online and salvaging some of the other wrecks. That was just a GDA destroyer here we can take down and deal with. Yeah. And then we've got enough resources to start building up Avengers again, really. I just feel this, like, really specific connection to those GDA ships. I don't really know why. I think I need to get yeah? them checked. Yeah. My lord? Um, uh, My lord! Um, I was so bad. I overdid the mic. So bad. <laughs> We need like the deepest my lord we can get. My lord. Yeah, it just it's not even deep at that point, it's just croaky, like it doesn't work. I'm like confused. Captain Hunter, how are we doing the small craft? Small craft is small going faster than it was yesterday. Yeah? Should have another one up in a couple minutes. Good stuff, very nice. Yeah, we went here yesterday, what was fun. Yeah, it's day off, yeah, company day off. Yeah. Fair enough. Uh, I'll put this in somewhere and we can just Get to what building another one, I think. Right. Actually, do we have enough? <laughs> what the hell was that ship that's been flying by? What? Hmm? Who's in this one? Hello there. I see you. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Is it? Oh, you got it. Come, come give me a hand on this one. We're just trying to take this one down. Oh, so you have a bit more experience, militaristically wise. Um, what kind of yeah, guns are we looking for? I'd say it's like the default, like battle cannons and stuff like that. Maybe some Vulcans, they always like the default. We've probably got a ton of Vulcan ammunition around here as well, because there's a few RDI wrecks. So I'm reckoning we might just repurpose those. Okay. Uh, I have blueprints if they're needed. Hmm. That'd be nice. Yeah, maybe finish on the walls or like to hand it over to someone else and see what else we can pick up, Colin. That'd be a good idea. Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh... I just turn around and there's a floating tower. <laughs> <laughs> And the Tower of Doom! <laughs> oh boy, the castle, when it gets full, just take it back to one of the cargo areas, connect to it, wait like 10 seconds and deconnect again, just because it'll all 20. Alright. And this is salvage. Now this is pod racing. No. Is it? Who is he? Oh, no. Jason Bourne is Jesus Christ. Jason Bourne is actually one of the most decorated RDI guy soldiers to ever live. True. Oh. Yep. He's the former Grand Admiral. Yep. Castle, what the hell is going on? I'm trying. It's, it's upside flipping. down. It's upside down. Are you stupid? Of course it's upside down. I told you this already. I wasn't listening. I was listening to a Jason Bourne joke. What part of, what part of it magnetized oh. itself to the ground? Did you not get? <laughs> the part where he did this. I was, oh, that was well though. done now, Jack. Mag oh, do you want, will you bloody fix it then, Mr. <laughs> fucking expert? That's what Christ. I was doing before you came over here on the side. The oh, well, sass me, you fucking Karen. You shagged it up, you know. 
stop this happening. Uh, you stay out of it. Would you like me to put on some other thrusters for you, Mr. Castle? Oh my god. Uh, some other thrusters would actually be really helpful, yeah. And that was how the Civil War began. <laughs> Another one. So, um... There's, there's, <laughs> no, there's no gyroscope on it. There's no thrusters that can help flip it. I was kind of doing that oh. out of sheer luck. And there should be gyroscope on this. <laughs> Repositioning the spotlight. Ow. Just watching this chaos unfold. Well, the rotors. The grind is still on it. Grinders are on it. Eh? We set them off. Just not draining the power. Oh no no no! They're not. They're not on. Oh, okay, I can just hear a grinder noise somewhere in the background. <laughs> I think that comes with the territory. Let's see if that helps him. <laughs> He's right, it's just the ambient noise of the planet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ambiance. 12 hours of DSC ambiance. I'm not sure if that'll help, but um... And there should be gyroscopes on that. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh. Most, almost. Oh, what was oh, that? What? Uh, it was do. probably the it's landing. Uh, yeah, that's one battery down. Oh, he's working, he's working. Why did I only hear half of an explosion? <laughs> half an explosion? <laughs> it wasn't half even what? the full, like, audio file. <laughs> well, it's because like... only one of the two batteries. It was only a small explosion. <laughs> this isn't your normal explosion. Oh no, I'm a fire. You have, to pay for, you have to pay for Explosion Plus in order to get the other half. New <laughs> DLC from Keen. Oh god! The engine's We're slowly stopped. turning this a bit Frankenstein-ish. <laughs> well, I'm not a builder, I'll, just, I'll give you that. Oh, neither no, am I. I'm just lazy. Oh, I like what you guys have done on the gate. It, mm. It's very Imperial Star Wars bunker, but I do like it. Well, I'll be have turned up, so... Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah. By the way, uh, Finn, when you get the get a chance, I might have an um, idea for what we can do for, like, a larger um, defense. It's, like, formation instead of just putting stuff on the buildings. I'm listening. Uh, when they get the assembly slash refinery era done... I've spotted something interesting on one of the ships. I'm going to see if I can turn that into a gun platform. Oh, Which ship? Um, the, um, the, the big kind of, I don't know, it's, it's a slappy one. They're, they're all, they all look purple. Oh, so the DIF ones. Yes. Um, one what of those interesting ones. Part of this oh, I see, um, yeah, one they, of the coil guns. Yeah, one of the coil guns. I'm thinking if we, I can dig around this, lift it up, um, and then install it near the base. Could do, yeah. It would certainly give us a good defense position. Mm-hmm. There's another burnt out one on the front as well, it's somehow still yeah. on fire. Uh, yeah, it's burning for quite a while. I don't know, Castle, did you set the thing on fire? I refuse to comment because RWR here now, so I am subject, uh, subject to liability. Right. Wow. Otherwise known as yes. I can neither confirm nor deny. I did not say it. Yeah, I meant you, my dear Holmes. Okay, he uh... To be fair, it could have just been the people who attacked us trying not to seem... Him, uh... They weren't. They were trying to be equal with what they destroyed. <laughs> Guys working on the walls. If you just finish welding that up, and then uh, honestly, that should be fine for the most part. Uh, maybe we'll get some guns or something. But like, I don't see any other reason yeah, to we... move it around. That's good enough. I quite like it. Yeah, it's looking good over. I like it. Are we gonna put a roof on it or not? No, no, no. Um, <laughs> honestly, it's not worth the resources. Okay, fair enough. Uh, it's just another thing to break. What if we get bombed? Uh, then we get bombed. <laughs> I, I, honestly, I don't yeah, think uh, um, <laughs> a light, light armored roof is gonna. I think that's the problem. Do much? Is that a grinder recharging <laughs> off of a grinder? Yes. Huh? Grind deception. Is that even possible? You clearly haven't had a night it... out in Bristol yet. Actually, it's <laughs> not. It's just sitting there out of power. Right. Yeah, I think we could use some more connectors for all our small ships, just to keep them charging. Um. Yeah, I could have to see that a sec. All right. Small steel tubes. 
Oh yeah, I queued up a bunch in the assembler. We have what better tools. He has loads. Do we have better tools? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, make still some elite ones. There were a few. Can't touch the vengeance. Uh, there's a, a big DOF for Yeah, that's what I'm I can neither you know. confirm or deny if we have any elite tools. I can also neither confirm or deny that I've buried some in an undisclosed location as backup plans. I'm carrying elite tools. I think we probably bought some on the Pioneer, which I've got to see, but obviously the Pioneer is not here anymore. But the thing is, Jack, you've also, you're also carrying admin perms, so... <laughs> yeah, and, um, and you're now carrying a P45. Yeah, oh, what was that, um, what was that perk you got on your character? Um, offline mining, Bullshit that's what it's called. Uh, yeah. Offline mining, yeah, yeah, yeah. Off, off camera. I mining, remember yeah. during Conley Wars, we did some offline mining, like an actual offline mining, and yeah. it ended up being worse than. Oh <laughs> my god! Because we broke like five different miners, yeah. the game crashed at one point. It was like, somehow, it's like, why are we bad? Oh, why do we do what we lost. do? Why are you gay? Why, why are, are we, we bad? All here in the background is plum, plum. We were actually worse off screen than on screen, and I didn't think that was possible. That's pretty impressive, to be fair. I mean, yeah, you can put your mind to it. Say again? And accepted. Time? Then have Say we again. ever been to the um, large wreck to the, like, on the far end of the mountain? Uh, what ends the far end to you? Because that's, uh, to that's subject to perspective. Finn, if you look back towards the base, look far right. Oh, is there's oh, like a metal path just. There's, uh, the, there's a wreck, like, inse built into the. Like, got stuck built into the mountain. If you think you can do something with it, go and have a look. Go for it. I'm going on an adventure. Um. Jack, I did have a question. Yeah. Without the pioneer. Yeah. What is our intention for leaving? Well, the Osiris should be back in contact at some point, so... Hmm. Well, that's what they always say. Yeah, but obviously plan. Admiral Shepard was checking out, like, something else, so maybe he's got distracted. Oh, Shepard oh, oh, Shepherd left me behind once as well. Right. I like to think with Shepard's, like, on, um, you know, like an asteroid base, just partying up at the minute, like, you know, like some dirty D&B room somewhere. Probably is. Worst case, we could Operator. just build a giant catapult and then find a volunteer to launch into the atmosphere. Yeah. Oh, I'll, I I'll volunteer as tribute. Yeah. I was kind of hoping you would. 100%. I, vol I volunteer for the Watney maneuver. <laughs> <laughs> okay, builders and experienced people of intelligence. What typically has... You're in the wrong place for that one. <laughs> <laughs> what typically has a lot of small steel tubes, because I want to be efficient with this. Uh, tanks. Yeah, tanks. Okay. Oh, yeah, if, you go, if, you go to the, if you go to the cargo containers towards the front end of the Vengeance, the yellow, con the yellow, the yellow, the yellow, the yellow cargo car containers... Door. Sat on the platform, there's about a thousand in there at least. Oh, really? All right, I'll grab them and move them over to our main thing. We went to the hub. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like that area has been cleared yet, so all those cargo containers have still got items. Did in you there. say the front of the Vengeance or the rear? Front. Where are you on about? So if you're looking at the front of the Vengeance, it's just over to the left hand side. So, where uh, I am now. So, oh, scene, around. scene, scene. Yep. Can you plop a connector on there? Sideways facing. No, not those ones. Not these ones. Okay. The ones that I am floating above. Right. Well, I can't see you, so. Keep coming this way. Do you have a signal? Uh, now I see you. Right. Keep coming. It's just over. There you go. Uh, yeah, if you want right, to. Yeah. yeah, I'll grab a connector. Oh, actually, mate, oh, they're all like apart. Now, don't bother about the connector. We'll just. Okay. Uh, We'll move him in by hand. They're old school. Ugh. Old school, though. This thing is an absolute rust bucket up here. Hey, yep. Like, I'm, I'm getting fucking sickness checking just out? looking at it. What are you checking at? Uh, oh. The wreck uh, I was mentioning about earlier. I wrecked this part of the mountain just now. 
Yeah, it's legit. Sure. Not sure how the hell we'd sell that. <laughs> also, just oh, just escape. Just just half an hour of condensed footage. Oh. Oh. What the hell was that? Explosions. That was my tool. Is it where? Uh, we're all good. Fine. That was just uh, the front of my. So ship. loud. Uh, it's all right. Yeah. That was insanely loud. <laughs> no it dented the walls. How did you manage that? That w that was the grinder and the welder. They weren't even turned on. <laughs> Make a whole damage, Captain. I, I don't know what's going on. Oh, not again. <laughs> okay. I'm having flashbacks of the war there. Uh. <laughs> doing it again. They're doing it again. Magnum, I saw I, I saw Magnum, salvaging Magnum. something. Telling them, I'm telling them. I started salvaging something and it hit me. And hey, you've not activated some sort of giant drone. Oh, it again, might not have been a... Mars. Are you familiar with the speedrunning term of proxy? No. It's when something hits you and then the game gets confused on where you are, so it just forces you out in a random direction at high speed. I'm in the oh. atmosphere. Oh, oh no. Or. Wait, what? Can you get back down? I don't. I don't see any signals. Oh, let me tell what down is. Please hurry up! I'm running out of hydrogen. I'm jumping and waving. Can you see me? <laughs> I can see. I can see mountains. <laughs> He's not even kidding. He's genuinely <laughs> up there. Did this? Did this? Did this ever? <laughs> <laughs> That's how we lost our first person. Okay, I see you. Okay, I got, I got chucked. Hey, like help. Five, I got chucked like five kilometers. Okay. In the I space of six seconds. I was about I'm to not, just I, give I, you I a GPS. You know. Probably safer that way. Yeah. Oh, safer living here, because I'm not knowing. Uh, this this refinery walk came together nicely. Uh, I've got the hydrogen and oxygen repaired, but I don't think it's plumbed into the main system yet. I am working. Oh, we have ice. What's this for? Hydrogen, oxygen. Oh, behind me. Yeah, behind. Me. Yeah, okay. Um, there's where the pipeline's running. Resource-wise, this giant rusted wreck doesn't seem to have much other than yeah. just scrap value. Alright, so we can mark up salvage at some point then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'd put it low on priority because there's a bunch of better wrecks we can do. Well, close, closer. Here to the base. Yeah, uh, that can be arranged. That's honestly <laughs> rank. I'd I'd put it as a rank D instead of a rank E salvage potential. Hey, where is Jack that? Jackie, Jackie. Isn't that like your thing? I, Jack, it's in my hey. office. Yeah. Back at HQ because it's never appeared ever since lost. Oh, so I'm safe for now. Can canonically, I retired with shotgun after the war. It's now in a rehabilitation program. Canonically, he's got carpal tunnel and both index fingers. It's going to therapy. Oxygen and hydrogen are now back. I now up just and swing running. the pistol on my fingers instead. Uh, <laughs> damn. Jack, to be fair, if it... I've taken to using a vintage service of off. <laughs> It's just a ballistic knife at the end. I just throw knives now. Oh, it was just a bad thing. What? We still don't have any ice, do we? No, we uh, need to... Some of the wrecks do have ice on board, so it's a case of recovering them. Oh, this... Ice! Ice? Unless we want to do a trip to the North Pole? <laughs> Would it be a waste of time looking for ice on the planet, then? Yes. Uh, well, actually, we could start a drill rig and go down to the water table. There is a drill rig right here, actually, that I'm flying. Isn't uh, there? Like drill rig down. Isn't there water like just along the river from us? What? Well, I'd hope there's yeah. water at the river. What? I mean, I can what? I can start British building a drill rig. Like. British. But we could be one at the back of the base. There's a perfect spot out the back of the oxygen and hydrogen one. Yeah, do that. Just remove some of the uh, old base. I, I've updated the connectors at the ship uh, dock now, so right. some of the grinds are docked to them, so just uh, take them off if you don't need them, because they'll be charging batteries and stuff at the minute. But we've got four tower connectors now, and they're all named and numbered correctly. We could build a hydro tanker. Usually, I don't have a castle. 
Yeah, it's just that it's on the side instead of the back, so it makes it really awkward compared. Yeah, it's a bit of a naff design, that one. 